and we are back again remember this thing the last time when we left it off it uh, it was still making a lot of rattling noise especially with the space bar well check it out now that's basically pretty silent and most of that rattling noise is gone which magical lube did i use this time that's what she said and i used the same lube as before it's vaseline Oh wait, before you start screaming, I have ordered a proper silicon grease from Amazon, it's on its way. But until then I thought I could try out one of the uh, suggestions that you guys gave me on Instagram. That's one of the things I love about this community, that every time I do something like an idiot, you are uh, sure to point it out. Well, shout out to Aditya, this person. He DM'd me on Instagram and suggested one of the methods of uh, lubing it with Vaseline and uh, it seemed to work quite well. Things you will need for this activity, Vaseline, 5 rupees, and some kind of a burnt out matchstick or an incense stick. First step is to remove the keycap obviously, and now Cosmic Byte being a budget brand they didn't provide you a keycap puller in the box and if you don't have one you can kind of make a DIY one with a string like this. Just put it across the edge of the key and gently pull, just like that. Eh, I could have done it better but you get the point. Push down the switch like this with one of your sticks and uh, apply a thick layer of Vaseline on it using another one. Just like that. Nice and disgusting. The stabilizers are a little different, like you have to lift them up apparently, like this, so that they come off of their uh, base, that's when you get access to the screws underneath. Ah, come on, epic fail on camera. Thankfully, I still have my manicure whatever kit with a bunch of tools that we can use so if you have a tweezer or something that works fine i'm gonna pick this hold the stabilizer up like this and apply all the grease you have in the gaps that it has underneath it so make sure you get the spring underneath because these two stabilizers are connected to each other it might take a while so be a little patient clear out your calendar first so when you're done, there should be Vaseline all over your table and on your hands. That means job well done. And that's that. You can just put the keycap back and let's see if that made any difference. I've also noticed that it makes less noise without those uh, height extenders for some reason. So if you keep it flat on the table, ah, look at that, it's much smoother now. And if I extend the legs here on the back, You notice it makes a little bit more noise. I think it's because of the inclination for some reason. So I recommend if you have one of those uh, uh, wrist rests down here and the height adjustment uh, pillow kind of a thing that you keep on the back of your keyboard, you know, it's made of foam material. So I suggest you do that instead of these legs. They don't cost that much. So if I get some myself, I'll let you know. Yeah, it sounds pretty good to me. 